Hey guys, welcome to another video for the South Texas Gardener. In this video, I'm going to give you an update on the tomatoes that I started from seed. Uh, you can go back to the previous video to see the different varieties that I have. I just want you to, sh I want to show you the differences in the tomatoes uh, plants that I've uh, potted a couple weeks ago. And these right here, pot uh, potted these a couple weeks ago compared to the ones that I uh, potted uh, maybe, where is it? A week ago okay whoops let me zoom back okay you see you can see there's quite a difference there's at least double the size of the ones that I've potted a couple weeks ago uh, a couple weeks ago to uh, barely a couple days ago actually and then these a couple weeks ago also so you can see there's a dramatic difference in size I just haven't had time to up pot everything and keep up with everything in the garden um, and you can see here I've had another another cycle of leaf fall uh, that's just because the trees are starting to bud now in the spring and uh, as the buds come out they push out the leaves that were remaining on the trees so as you can see here i've been trying to keep up with up hiding my plants a lot of these i'm going to give away and i also have my cactus plants there or my cactus um, seedlings and uh, i've got a lot more i've got like two more trays of cactus that i'm growing uh, i just love growing things and watching them you know grow up and so just to show you this one for example so one of the things that i do is i cut i pinch off the cotyledon leaves these are the first leaves that show up these are the embryonic leaves and the uh, plants i cut those off and i might even snip this and snip, snip this one off when i put it into a one gallon pot and i put dirt up to about this level because what happens with tomatoes is that this stem will actually grow uh, more roots and the more roots you have the more nutrition uptake you have and the bigger and the more fruit production you're going to end up with so as you can see here see these have the cotyledon leaves and they already have mature tomato leaves so i don't have to worry about these little ones anymore and then when i pot this one i'll probably put it up to here maybe even even up to here you know just leave a couple of inches i know like i have a nice little one foot uh, plant there and when i up pot it it doesn't look like much but they grow pretty fast they come up uh, in no time and those as those roots develop and as I, what i usually typically do how i know that i need to pot see i need to pot this one up um you start to see the roots kind of pop out a little bit once i start to see the roots pop out that's when i know that it's time to up pot it uh, because i don't want the roots to to get all bound and um and tangled up in there uh, this is no reason for that so in any case um that pretty much is the update for the tomatoes. Uh, we've got our temperatures are dropping into the low, I mean, to the high mid 40s in a couple of days. So all of this I'm gonna put inside for each night and then bring them out at night so they can get a nice dose of pure sunlight. Um, I've taken them out from my growing uh, operation, I guess, if you will, uh, in the office. And I've brought them out because the temperatures are great. The lows are in the high 50s, uh, mid 60s and that's perfect lows for tomatoes um, they can probably handle the high 40s too but I just don't want to risk it um, I don't want to risk them being stunted and whenever it says like I always kind of have like a, a, a give or take five degrees of you know it could be either five degrees warmer or cooler and given that that uh, percent error there I'd rather not risk it and I'll just keep them indoors and then I'll bring them out bring them back out in the morning it only takes me like five minutes so that's nothing to for you know to make sure that I have a good crop this year and then when I give plants away I want to make sure I'm giving good plants not stunted ones so in any case that does it for this video uh, that's the update on the tomatoes from the original seed containers to my uh, cup upgrades to then my gallon upgrades up there okay thanks for watching catch you in the next one